Hello there and welcome back to my videos. In this video I want to speak about the Python and the Django framework. And in this video about Django I want to explain a little bit about the UL mapping with the regular expression and how it's working. So you always know uh, how it will be working. And uh, it's a pretty easy and I hope you will stay here with me in the full video. It's not so long so I really hope you, you want to see it to the end. Before we are starting, I really hope you want to subscribe this uh, just a channel so you can get new videos from me. I really love to teach people. And uh, then I really hope you give uh, feedback or if you have any questions or something like that. And don't forget to share and uh, like this video. And I think that's it, so let's begin. The first step we're gonna do is uh, going uh, up for the views. We have here from the last video we have the index here so now i'll create uh, a post we are building the, the block uh, plugin something like that that's what i want to demonstrate i'll not finish that and uh, this uh, view called post i want to make a request and then we just say return http and then I will just say, uh, let, let's call it the uh, post uh, detail. And uh, then I'll say post detail view page. And that's what we're gonna do right now. Then going back for the, the URLs here. And inside the, the URLs, we can create one more here. I'll just duplicate this and uh, we just say post detail and i'll just call it post detail here and normally you can just use the one and that will work fine so let's uh, so let's go in inside and try this python manager uh, run server and uh, of course if i run this it's still working you see this is the old page, if I do this one, it will use this uh, page here. I'll just scroll a little bit up so you can see what's happening. And the first one here. And if I type 2, it's crying and say we have some kind of errors here because we don't, we only have the post and post 1. We did not have the post 2. That's what we're gonna, gonna do, new, uh, do now with the, using the regular expression. So let's go back to the editor and enable the regular expression. The first step we want uh, to be sure is we have uh, read re underscore path uh, imported it's staying for regular expression path and that's what we're gonna work with so this path would be re underscore path and uh, now we basically have access for everything now just uh, type r as uh, now we are running the regular expression and uh, then we use the, the error here and say D, it's meaning it should be a digit number. So if you use ABC, it's what's not working. If you use one, one, two, three, or one, two, three, four, then it's what's working. So that's going for demonstrate this one. And going back for the one, you can see we have the, we can do whatever we want here, whoops. And this will working if I use the A first it will not work. So right now it's working as we expect. But the problem could be we don't know how the uh, what, what the number is. We cannot take this number right now. Uh, only if we take the UL and explode and take the last number and take it out. But don't worry. We have a uh, much better way. So let's copy this one. And I'll just comment this out so we don't use this anymore. The only thing you, the the single thing you can do now, it's uh, use the this one and p, and then you say uh, number. I'll explain it after that, and let's come here and yes. Now we can say we use this as we as we're crying to to fix this, and then we're going inside, and the first step we say you need to buy the p. It's staying for binding for the params as a number. So this regular expression match we hit here will be bind for the number. 
And then we can go in back for the view file here and we can just do this one the number uh, and that's what we're gonna do now and uh, I will just say number here and then I'll show you what's happening that's going back for the browser and demonstrate what happened and you can see 543 and we can just say one and we can say two and everything fits as it's doing so congratulations you have uh, working with the regular expression and uh, uh, ul path inside the Django and I really hope you enjoy this video and I hope you want to subscribe you can go in uh, down below in the right corner and press on the ding then you will subscribe my channel and I really hope you will can give any, some kind of feedback if you have uh, something you want to say or if you have any, some kind of questions and, and like that. I really appreciate to answer everyone I can uh, remember to do and then I really hope you want to share this uh, video with your friends and like it on the like button below. Thank you so much and hope to see you next time. Bye.